All right, what's up, guys? It's Super here, and welcome back to some more Dragon Ball Fighters story mode. And we just got done with the Super Warrior arc, and now we're taking on the Enemy Warrior arc. We're only 26% done with the story completion, meaning, you know, all the cutscenes, all the special events, and of course, the new Enemy Warrior arc, and then this one, which is probably gonna be like a glimpse into the backstory of Android 21. So I can't wait for that one because I'm still very anxious to see where she came from and what the hell's going on, why she's a Majin and an Android at the same time. So here we go, let's start on the enemy arc. Parunga, grant me my wish. All your wishes have been granted. Farewell. Ooh, and the plot thickens. So it looks like Android 21 and 16 went to Namek and got a couple of wishes from Parunga. I think Perunga grants three wishes, if I'm not mistaken. So what does she wish for? Oh, all the bad guys are back. That's what she wished for. This is GT all over again. The portals of hell have been opened, and they're all back. I wonder if I'm going to be able to play with every single one. Obviously not the Ginyu Force. I'll just play with Ginyu, but... Hey, can you hear me? I see you're awake. How are you feeling? I'm all right, considering. Hmm. Looks like the link system is working properly then. You probably have a lot of questions. But first, allow me to introduce myself. I am 16. An android created by the Red Ribbon Army. We don't have much time, so I'll be brief. Right now, you're linked with an alien named Frieza. Basically, it's like you've possessed Frieza's body. So Frieza's the main um, catalyst in the enemy story you just arc. Take a look for yourself. Oh gosh, why do I only have four toes? Why does it make that sound when I walk? Why am I naked? It may surprise you, but this is all real. We were planning to link your soul with Goku's, but one thing led to another and you ended up linked to Frieza. This may sound strange, but just relax. There's a way for you to return to your body. It's... Hello. Can you hear me? If you can hear me, then answer me. I'm scared. It seems as if Frieza's soul has awakened. Frieza can hear my voice, but only you can hear his. Now, try saying something to Frieza. No, I don't want to. <laughs> <coughs> Hello, nice to meet you. You're ill-mannered, but at least you can make an introduction. Which is surprising, to say the least. Even then, I find it hard to forgive you for even trying to speak to me. Intolerable. How to free Frieza. Hmm. You have arrived, finally. Let's just say, good thing you weren't another minute late. I don't need to explain things, do I? Now then, there are several questions I have for you. First, I want you to begin by explaining to me what's happening right now. I'm just glad there are no parades here, like in that hell of a flower garden. <laughs> Silence, scout! <laughs> you know absolutely nothing about the hell I've been through! <laughs> day after dreadful day. They forced me to watch that painfully awful, cheerful parade! Just thinking about it fuels me with enough rage to lose my mind! So angry, I could erase you right here and now! Do it, bitch! Tell me all you know, I dare you! Every little bit. Unless you want to make me even angrier. Oh, let's make him angrier, Obey please. Me, or you will regret it. Frieza. Damn it! I want her to make him angrier. I don't know how much you've heard, but there's no time for a full explanation. I'll summarize the important points. By using the Link system, another soul has taken over your body. You will not be able to use your power, nor will you be able to defeat enemies. <laughs> okay, enough with all these stupid jokes. Time to get serious, or I am going to erase you right here and now. It's just 
how impossible it is for someone to ever take me over. Are you listening to me? I've received no response. Are you two conversing? Well, I suppose there's no use in pondering it. I'll just continue with the conversation. What? This can't be! I attacked just now. Why did nothing happen? This will not stand! Just so you know, going wild inside your mind will change nothing. You just need to give it up and listen. <laughs> there is only one way to fix this situation. Listen, you need to allow that soul to control your body and experience as many battles as possible. Let it control me? You mean my only hope is to let someone else use my body as they please? That isn't even remotely funny. Now if you would, please stop standing there and give me back my body. Otherwise it would be my pleasure to erase you from existence. Again with this freezer, come on. on the outside. But you and I are both on you. You will not be able to do anything. <laughs> I'm going to leave now. <laughs> it seems that you'll finally realize your place. Do as I say, and I may be inclined to forgive your transgressions. <laughs> he thinks I'm going to listen to him. <laughs> are we back? Or is this Frieza? <clears throat> Don't tell me, you. I'm so glad we can now finally talk to one another. But I'm not interested in hearing your excuses. The soul inside you must have handed off control. I guess this will make things faster, though. Enough small talk. Now, prepare to die. <clears throat> but I thought... I regain control over my body. Now do you get it? Your only hope is to leave the fighting to the soul inside you. The power of the link allows you to move. But if it's removed... <laughs> you are going to pay for this. Not only did you seal away my power, but you also let this Cretan possess me. Just so there are no misunderstandings, I was the one that started up the link system. But your power was sealed by a different person. What? Why? Her name is Android 21, the current leader of the Red Ribbon Army. If you fight a great deal and power yourself up, you may be able to stop her. May be able to stop her? Don't you know who you're dealing with? If what you say is the truth, then all I need to do is erase her. If you do that, you will never get back to normal. What do you mean? Are you trying to threaten me? Only she knows how to break the seal on your soul and your power. This is truly ridiculous. Do you really think that any of this is believable? Still, at this rate, we're never going to get anywhere. I hope you listened to all of that just now. Words, earthling maggot. It appears that my only way out of this extremely vexing situation is to let you fight. Unfortunately for you, there is just no other option. From now on, you are my servant. Fight like your life depends on it, and make sure you don't disgrace me out there. So this, this is our first opponent, Yamcha. They gave me Yamcha for my first opponent to face. Ready? Oh, Go! Huh. why me? Guess I'll give you a fright. Guess I'll give you. Ah! Guess I'll give you a fright. Ah! Oh, that's right. Freeze is one of those characters that doesn't have a way to launch them up further, such as this. All right, hold on. Let me show you how truly powerless you are. Yes. Just call me golden. Please. Show him the gold. I'll 
destroy everything! Everything! Oh my, it talks. This one seems a little different than all those other pathetic specimens. I'll tear you! Limb from limb! Well, it may be capable of speaking, but it seems just as pitifully stupid as the others. Oh well. Might as well kill a little time with a display of my superior strength. Huh? What's going on? I thought you were just another Cretan, but you actually have a modicum of skill. Well, I did go a little easy on you, but you still survived my attacks. Wait, he... Frieza's supposed Wait, to know Nappers. Is that you? Lord Frieza? Oh, oh, so you do know your place after all. Please, forgive me! It's me, Nappa, the Saiyan. I used to work for you. Don't you remember me? Nappa. Hmm. Now that you mention it, that name does ring a bell. My apologies, Lord Frieza! It, it just... You, you, you've changed forms from, from when I last had the honor of meeting you. Oh, so this was the first time you've seen me in my current form, then? Still... If one cannot recognize one's master, does that not constitute an absence of loyalty? Damn, no of mercy. Not. Come hell or high water, I would do your bidding to the letter, Lord Frieza. I wouldn't need to test you on that statement now, would I? But if you do mean it, you will devote your life to serving me. Is that clear? That wasn't terrible. Seems like you might have a knack for this. If you can tap into a little more of my power, we should be able to interrogate Android 16. Huh, <laughs> you mad. <laughs> yeah, let's let's see. Of course I am. Someone will pay dearly for putting me in this position. You mad, Frieza? Someone linked me with an earthling maggot and is trying to use me. There is no doubt about it. You can't actually believe anything that comes out of that man's mouth. If so, you are a puke-inducing simpleton. I don't know what his true goal is, but he must be hiding something. Oh, I see. Now I understand. It seems like he originally intended to link you with that Saiyan after all. That Saiyan? Hey, you talking about Kakarot? And since when have you been allowed to speak to me in that manner? <laughs> Shall I remove that big mouth of yours? Oh, no, Wipe no, it Lord off, Frieza. Lord Frieza. It was just my misunderstanding. I thought it was the maggot inside of you speaking, Lord Frieza. <laughs> I sincerely hope that's the case. Nappa, even you could prove to be an important pawn in a situation this dire. I trust you know what will happen if you don't show adequate results. Of course I do, sir. I won't let you down. Now that's more like it. I expect great things from you. Tch, that Frieza's such a jerk. Ooh, what was that, Nappa? Did you say something? No, sir, not a thing. Ready? Okay, so here we go with Nappa. Go. Nappa was I'm one of the uh, big surprises <laughs> in the beta because I really enjoyed playing. Um, I really enjoyed playing him. Let's go. Of course, I only know like his basic basic combo, which of course I'll take him in a training mode, but. And being able to put down the Cybermen is something that's really interesting. Because the Cybermen stay even if you get hit. The only way the Cybermen go away is if... Um, is if they actually receive a physical hit. Napper. Such a hard hitter, man. It feels like I didn't even touch him. Time to pick oh, up another one of my loyal you servants. To life at a most opportune moment. Come along then. You work for me now. Beware, you little fool. I'll destroy anybody who gets in my way. Huh? First he forgets to pose, and then he ignores Lord Frieza's direct command. Who is this Mr. person? My dear Captain, I'll see to it you remember who follows the orders around here and who will be the one giving them. Ooh, Captain Ginyu, you're in trouble now. Cause I'm angry! Guess 
This is the thing you're calling. Let me show you my new form. This is my new form. I'll give you a little taste of it. Shoot the death beam. Ooh. I said death beam. Death beam. Death beam. Oh my god. Death beam. Death beam. Death beam. There we go. Who's the boss now, bitch? I humbly apologize for defying you, Lord Frieza. I was being manipulated. I promise it won't happen again. Whatever your excuse may be, I cannot accept insurrection in the ranks. However, I'm willing to let it slide just this once, as I am in need of able-bodied fighters. Lord Frieza? Do... do you really mean that? I do. But in exchange, I expect you to serve me until your dying breath. Thank you, Lord Frieza. You have my word. I promise I won't let you down again. Strike a pose. Listen up. The merciful Lord Frieza has given us a chance to return to his army. Now we will express our eternal joy and gratitude in the form of a dance. You really needn't bother. Oh, as you wish, my lord. <laughs> Hard my ass. I want to see it. Is it really a good thing they're back to normal? Seems to me they were better off the way they were before. I see your point. But in my army, all that matters is results. My apologies for the wait, Lord Frieza. The Ginyu Force has assembled. How excellent. I'm expecting great things from you and the Ginyu Force. Thank you, Lord Frieza. Honestly, it is truly an honor to serve you again. Shall I perform my dance of joy? Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. I am. If you like, I can perform a special version of the dance. <laughs> the dance of joy. Oh, yeah. Awesome. I always hate that a raccoon's voice. I'm not gonna lie. Too. No, that's unnecessary. Let's save the dancing for later, shall we? As you wish. After the matter is resolved, the Ginyu Force and I will perform the most splendid dance for you. I'm looking forward to your recital. <laughs> Listen up. This is our chance to impress Lord Frieza. I want all of you to practice until showtime. You can count on us, Captain Ginyu. Whether it's on the battlefield or off, we'll be sure to dance a Lord Frieza with our moves. All right, man. Now that that's decided, let's show this enemy the might of the Ginyu Force. Ginyu Force. Let's go. Yes, sir. <laughs> Wish he'd do something about that eccentric personality of his. Oh, come on, Lord Freeze. You gotta have a little bit of fun, man. Ginyu Force is one of the best things to ever happen in Dragon Ball. Seriously, I love, 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 love the Ginyu Force. All right, so this is actually my first time playing with Captain Ginyu. Cap Ginyu! So let's see what he's all about. I do know that you call his assist with a key button. So let's check him out real quick. Like I said, first time using him. That was a quarter circle. Forward. Okay, that's cool that he could do that. So whenever you press a normal... Whenever you press a normal key button, you get a different assist. You know what's gonna be crazy when you start calling in your assist, you know, stuff like that. And you call in you call in the Guinea Force. Call in your assist. It's gonna be pretty crazy, man. I could already see the lockdown potential of this character. Well, I don't know what the assists do per se, like all of them. But just having the ability to call all of these, like very, very fast. It's just stuff on the screen. Like that. Like, there is just so much stuff on the screen at once. I can't wait to actually take him in training mode. Does he have a traditional? Oh, he does. Does he have a splat? Okay, he does. Okay, that's good. 
Because then you get your level one super, or you could, uh, you know, get your assist started and start your offense pretty nicely whenever you get a splat. Frieza and Cell, the dream team. Time to recruit Very the cool. second now that we have Captain Ginyu side of us, the coin as far as most popular well. bad guys. Oh, I forgot I gotta Lord press. I'm Frieza, drinking something. Are you sure it's okay? To let that Earthling freeloader remain in your body. Of course not. I detest the thought. But I need that maggot to draw out all of my power. When you consider the dangers we face, letting a maggot roost in one's body doesn't seem that bad. All things considered, I'd like to gather us some more pawns, however. So, they revived you too. Now, things are getting interesting. Hey, You're gonna work for me now, what Cell. What business do you have with Lord Frieza? My name is Cell. I would be more than happy to join, if you're sure you want to play. What? Behave, Nappa. You will soon learn that. Smart mutts know when to stop their barking. But, but sir! Nappa, Lord Frieza gave you an order. Your subordinates seem rather undisciplined. Is the Frieza Force nothing but a group of half Hey, you better watch your tongue. Captain Ginyu. Not you too. I think it's best to hear what Bug Boy has to say. <laughs> Lord Frieza just saved your life, punk. All right then. Let's get down to business. Where is the being who revived me and allowed some strange soul to take complete control of my body? Strange soul? You mean they did the same thing to you? Perhaps she plans to utilize many more people than we realized. Excuse me? Even if we did, Whoops. who says we need to Whoopsie. share this with you? <laughs> I... First, you need to show me some respect. Ask me nicely, and I just may consider it. <laughs> what an unbelievably banal request. I don't care what you want. Tell me. Everything you know. I see. It would appear that this fellow is much slower in the head than I first assumed. Isn't that special? No matter. I'll just have to teach you the hard way. And uh, the answer is. Guess I'll give you a fright. I don't know if you guys would agree, but I think Frieza is a lot more popular than so. So that definitely made it easier choice. Plus, it makes it for a better. I think it makes it for uh, you know better banter between Frieza and Goku because you know. Ooh, let me get that level three. Because Frieza legitimately hates Goku and all the Saiyans. Like he despises them. While Cell is more. You know, he wanted to be the most powerful being. He's evil and everything, but he just wanted to be, like, strong and, and test his perfect power. So I, I like the choice of Frieza coming back to Super. You seem much different from the data I have on you. It's like you've become something completely different all of a sudden. Why is it, Frieza? I'm getting the sense... There's another energy inside you. You are somehow different from me. Like you've been possessed by another being's soul. If we're so different, then please explain what it is inside of you. Ah, well that is another story. I have something akin to an artificial soul that has been pre-programmed. Which would explain why I find it so easy to control. What? You can control the soul inside you? Indeed. In fact, it was so easy to overpower that I didn't even need to waste my time and effort expelling it. Hmm. I don't know who's inside of you right now, but thanks to their soul, your full power is at your disposal. I'm correct, aren't I? Surely. Being linked with this Earthling must be what allowed me to tap into some of my power. Although, my true power is so much greater than this. Interesting. There must be some logical mistake then. The data I have on you must be outdated. Amusing. How about I allow you to come and work for me? Lord Frieza, if I may. 
I don't believe it would do us well to work with this creature. I agree. There's no telling when that freak might betray us. None of this matters. Cell doesn't work for anyone. However, you could all prove to be of actual use to me. I suppose I don't mind teaming up with these temporary so be it. I suppose there are small benefits in a group effort. Nevertheless, if you prove useless or dare to betray me, then I will be forced to erase you. No hard feelings. None at all. <laughs> the same goes for both sides. What's going on? It's Super here, and thank you for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you guys subscribe if you are not already. Also, check out any of these videos linked at the top. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.